Hey everyone, welcome back. In this video, we're going to start using the Lottie Files plugin for WordPress and check out some of the things you can start doing with it. Let's get started. So I've got rid of the animation we used uh, previously, uh, loading it up with code. So now we're gonna start off with the Lottie Files plugin. So I've installed the plugin. It's under my installed plugins here. And if it's installed correctly, you should have the Lottie files icon here. And you can customize some of the settings um, to your liking. So once that's done, you can head into your pages and get started using the plugin. So let's just have an animation for our landing page uh, that auto plays and loops when the page is loaded. So you can add a block and you should be able now to select the Lottie block. So that's really awesome. And here we've got some controls and some things you can do with it. We'll check that out just in a second. So once you create the block, you can either insert them from a URL, the media library or the discovery page. So here, if you go to discover animation, you get the most recent animations on Lottie files. You can, you can also get the featured ones, uh, which are featured on the front page and popular animations. And up here, you have your animations. So you have your downloads, your likes, your public animations. I don't have any, or your private ones. And then you can also import by browsing or dragging and dropping your animations. So I'm gonna go into my animations, my private ones, go back a page and select this one and insert it. So there we go. And what's really awesome is seeing this animation live uh, in the editor rather than just a HTML block like we saw previously. Um, so now we can check out some of the animation settings. So, the first option we have is play animation on. So we can either play it on page load, which is sort of like the autoplay option, hover, click or scroll. Uh, we're gonna start off with page loading. I'm gonna leave loop on. I'm gonna leave, actually no, I'm gonna remove controls, leave the speed at one, width and height. Uh, we got background colors. So by default, it's set to white. If you click on it and click on it again, you get a transparent background. And then in advanced mode or in advanced settings, you can change the play mode uh, to normal or bounce. So bounce is playing the animation from start to end and then end to start, so backwards. Uh, I'm just gonna leave it on normal for the moment. And direction, forward or backwards, and additional CSS classes, which we don't need for the moment. So that's all set up correctly. Um, this might be a bit small, as you can see the animation here in the editor. Um, and then, you know, if you removed it, you can see the changes straight away, uh, which is just really, really awesome. So here I've set it up like I want it to be, and I'm going to save the draft preview, preview in a new tab. And as simple as that, we have now got animations on our WordPress website, both visible in the editor and then obviously the preview page. So that is wonderful. So that was a great little introduction to the Lottie plugin for WordPress. And as you can see now, we have our animations live in the editor, which is really awesome. In the next few videos, we're gonna be covering more ways you can use Lottie animations in your WordPress website. So be sure to check them out. Cheers.